Hey guys, how's it going? For those of you that have been watching, I have been in Malaysia for the past few days, uh, cleaning up some loose ends with my trike and shipping comp some components to Australia and, and gathering other components for what will be the next leg of the trip. We are in Kuala Lumpur's international section of their airport here, and I'm about to board a flight pretty soon, like within the next three or four hours, to Vienna. Actually, it's gonna be Istanbul first and then Vienna. It's a long flight. It's gonna be a bit arduous, but I wanted to make this video so that you guys can kind of get an idea of what to look forward to when we get to uh, Vienna, because we have an action-packed three weeks planned, um, and it's gonna be travel, it's gonna be culture, and it's gonna be a lot of cycling. So if you guys miss my cycle tour, you miss that like psych sort of cycling end of things, if you like recumbents, if you like recumbent trikes, then you guys are gonna love the next three weeks. So, uh, a gentleman by the name of Hansa is, is one of the team at Azub. Azub is a recumbent bike and trike company in the Czech Republic that uh, reached out to me a while back, invited me to the Czech Republic so that I could build a trike uh, in order to continue my cycling end of the journey. Even though they knew I, I, I bought the van, I also do want to be able to cycle around and have, have that experience because I really miss cycling. And uh, they reached out to me and said, hey, if you're, if you're going to keep cycling as a part of your life, let's help you accomplish that goal and get you a trike. Coincidentally, after I, I talked to them, Malaysia opened up, I was able to get here, take my trike, take some pieces off my old trike, and then bring them uh, with me in the bags and the luggage to uh, to Vienna. Um, they're gonna pick me up in Vienna, and that's when the, the a trip is really gonna begin. Um, so without further ado, let me read you the itinerary that was given to me by Hansa on behalf of Azub so that you can kind of get an idea of what we have to look forward to. Firstly, Hansa is gonna meet me at the airport in Vienna, and he's gonna meet me with a few cycles. I, I don't know if they're going to be trikes. I don't know if they're going to be recumbent bikes. I don't know. What I do know is that Hansa is excited to take me out for a few hours cycling around Vienna. So like right off the bat, as soon as we arrive, we're going to be uh, in it. You know, we're going to be able to say that we are, are exploring. And so uh, I thought that we, he was going to pick me up from Vienna and we were going to just drive all the way back to uh, his his office, Azub's office in, in the Czech Republic. But he is so excited about accomplishing some fun goals, making a trip that's full of exciting activities, that uh, I was, I was really, I'm really happy. So again, let me read this. It says, hey Matt, here is the plan and some information around. Besides the weekdays, we also have three weekends ahead of us that we can spend together. The first one, the fourth and the fifth, there's a recumbent event nearby. We will go Friday there. It should take, uh, he's gonna take his son and daughter and you're gonna meet uh, Hansa and his family, which I'm very excited about. Um, and so that will be an event. The second weekend is a bit open. There's a promo event nearby and I'll be more than welcome to go. They're encouraging me, encouraging me to go to certain events. They're giving me a lot of assistance on cool things to do while I'm here. They want to make uh, this trip as fun-filled and action-packed as possible, so I'm very appreciative of that. He also said he has a cottage in the mountains, and he's like, if you're up for it, maybe we'll go to the cottage in the mountains. So I think we're really going to get to know a man named Hansa. This is just a name right now. But in a few episodes after this, it'll be much more than just a name. It'll be, you guys are going to get to know Hansa. A lot like you've gotten to know a lot of other people in my journeys uh, around the world. The third weekend, the 18th and the 19th, uh, I hope that you already have your own trike. So we can do a tour together around the Slovakian castles starting on Wednesday. Or maybe some Slovenia or Alps or so. But I would prefer the first option as we could start 
and end at the same point. So that's gonna be super cool. We're gonna take almost a week and uh, we're gonna uh, we're gonna go to some Slovo Slo Slovakian castles and what the cool thing is, is is that he knows some castles where we can actually camp so we can camp out at these like um, abandoned castles and I'll be able to fly the drone I'll have some really really cool video it's gonna be awesome it's gonna be epic um, and we'll do it all on the new trike which is amazing so um, he said, I talk about weekends mostly because I need to plan things around with my family. So he's, he's working around his family's schedule. You're definitely welcome to any event, weekend or whatever for yourself. Um, my daughter is looking forward to practicing English with me. Um, the cottage in the mountains is beautiful and you are more than welcome to spend a weekend with us. After all the lockdowns, it will be nice to have a guest. That's a nice attitude, I like that. He basically talks about some of the days he's working and when he's in the office, he works pretty hard. Obviously, he's a good worker at Azub. You're, you're lucky to have him. Uh, the first week could be a little crazy. Um, when planning your visit, I thought um, he's working on his house and it would be ready, but the house isn't ready yet. So um, he needs to go to the cottage and uh, do some woodworking. So I told him, that maybe, maybe we'll go to his cottage and we'll help him work on some housework at his cottage, which might be interesting, helping him to build his cottage in, in, <laughs> in the mountains um, of Czech Republic. That sounds fun to me. Maybe we can bring the trikes and do some uh, trail riding or do something unique. That would be neat. So th there's an opportunity there for not only cycling, but, but some really interesting travel experiences as well. My colleague Milan, our product manager, is planning visits to companies where the frame will be welded, painted, wheels laced, etc. At least one trip will require a couple of hours in the car, so only Wednesday or Monday is possible. I hope to go the first Wednesday, 1st of June, or Monday the 6th. The other visits will be shorter in terms of traveling, so we can do those any day. So this is kind of cool. We're gonna go and actually see how these trikes are made. They have some titanium components. It's gonna be painted uh, according to whatever I want. Uh, we're gonna discuss the styling and painting of the trike when, uh, when I get there. And we're gonna do it all. I mean, this trike is gonna be a really a hands-on and crafty experience in partnership with Azub. So I'm super excited about that. I'm super excited to share it with you. We also have some opportunities to see some suppliers like the uh, maybe maybe the wheels, maybe the roll-off speed hub, possibly, but maybe not. The Schlumpf drive. There's all sorts of suppliers around Europe, and this might be our chance to check some out. Um, I also have some other important work. Uh, to do so that doesn't include you. Um, you'll have your own table in our office and access to anything you'll need. So I don't think you'll be bored at any time, which is cool. I mean, every time we have an experience, that means that I have to dedicate time to edit that experience into a video that I put on the channel. And so, of course, it can't all be fun and games. It's gotta be some work, so um, that's pretty cool. That's all I have uh, for the general time plans, but this is what we're gonna do for videos. So, so these are the videos that we're gonna work on. Here is the one we simply have to do. Your vlog about a complete build of your own trike. So that's gonna be the crux of this trip. It's gonna be me documenting the building of my recumbent trike. And we're gonna do that in the factory. We're gonna have it, the whole team around. It's gonna be super cool. Also, a vlog about visiting Azub and things in the company. So I told him, no problem, we can do that. A vlog about our longer tour. So a vlog about actually going to the castles and doing, which all of this stuff, it's not like <laughs> he's telling me that's, that's stuff that he'd like to have, but this was also stuff that I was planning on doing anyways. He would like an Aza production video, um, like, like a video about Aza because, you know, while I'm there, you know, I can help him with a bunch of videos, so I told him that. And about Aza video, like maybe the history of Aza. Um, here is some extra things that would help me out a lot. A series of explanatory videos where I would use your perfect English. I can make the cut in filming and, and can do the cut even after you leave. Uh, we would only need to do the filming. 
So easy, just lending my voice, talking about the trikes, doing some things. Here's what he, he says he has some plans. How to adjust a trike properly, how to adjust the bike properly, how to mount and dismount the front wheels, how to adjust the toe-in. Basically the toe-in is the wheels, depending on how the two wheels in the front adjust. How to operate, how to operate the Shimano Steps Bors, Bros, Bros Smog motor. Introduction of our new padded trike seat. We also need to find a name for it, so maybe you can help me with that as well. How to choose your right trike, suspension, seat height, wheel size, rack, gears, brakes, whatever. The, the, I mean, there's a lot to do. You would be very welcome to introduce yourself as Jayo at the beginning of every video, but they would be generally Aza videos, and they should be rather short. I'm, I've, I've done a bunch of videos like that, so that's pretty cool. So I might be the spokesman on Azub on their website for people who are looking for information about how their trikes work and how to uh, adjust and, and cater them to whomever is going to be the rider. Here are some other ideas. We can help each other out as influencers. You as Jayo, me as chief editor of recumbent.news. That's Hansa is the chief editor for recumbent.news. You can type it in and check it out. I can do an interview with you. I thought we can do some interesting behind the scenes of Jayo's work where I can fly my drone filming you flying your own and capturing all the other work that you do. I want to start to do more recumbent videos for recumbent.news YouTube channel and I've had an idea about recumbent school series, a uh, school where I would explain how to learn to ride a two-wheeler, how to ride uh, in the terrain in the city, which accessories to use, etc. Which would be fun because I haven't ridden a recumbent bike a lot and this might be fun. He could literally teach me how to ride a recumbent bike and that would be the video teaching me. I know there is more work that we can do in such a short time but I would really like to use your English, make as much shooting as we can, and edit everything later. Fluent English without any accent is a big issue of our videos, so that's why I think this way. And I always think big. I think I can do way more than I'm capable of, and a little smiley face. We will go step by step and see what we can do at the end. Of course, there's, there has to be time for your own shooting and editing as well. So that's it. Looking forward so very much to see you on Monday. So that's it. Hansa Gala, Marketing Manager, Aza Bike SRO, www.azub.cz or azub.eu. EU must be the English one. So check out their website. And um, yeah, that's the trip. So in the next series of videos, probably the next <laughs> a lot of videos, we're going to be in Europe, we're going to be exploring the area, we're going to be cycling, we're going to be fixing cottages in the mountains, we are going to be also talking to locals, exploring the lives of the people living in this area, maybe talk a little bit about the Ukraine situation, maybe talk a little bit about just in general what's going on. So without further ado, I'm going to, I'm going to get on the plane, I'm super excited uh, and I'm, I'm, I'm really excited to share it with you. I'm a little bit nervous, I'm a lot out of shape, and maybe over the course of this three weeks I can get into a little bit better shape. But the other thing that Hansa said is he says, you're coming to the Czech Republic, you better like your beer. So <laughs> it might not be the best healthy experience. I'll, I'll be cycling and then I'll be carbo loading. And I'll be cycling and then I'll be carbo loading. But I hear the beer there is pretty good. Anyways, if you have any questions or comments, let me know. If you're interested in anything, you let me know. Um, the trike that I'll be building is a TIE Fly. Um, I'm not 100% sure if I'll have the TIE Fly 26 or the TIE Fly X, but it will be a TIE Fly variety. And uh, we'll be exploring all their trikes while we're there. Um, if you got, like I said, if you have any tips or tricks or anything, let me know. Bye.